when it comes to the greatest destruction in water then the name of titanic comes in our mind because it was the most luxurious ship which had to be seen destruction in its first journey and friend when it comes to the sky height then air ship is starts from in our mind which was the most luxurious ship of the world in its time yes guys you understand absolutely right we are talking about hindenburg ship when it start burning then within 30 second the air ship was blown and its accident is similar to titanic so guys first of all us let me tell you that a german commercial air ship was made by japlin company and the length of the ship is 245 meter it is nearly tall as 13 story building and at that time it was being built by the two methods were the most used to float the air ship the first was to use helium gas and the second was the hydrogen gas and most helium gas used at that time helium gas is suitable gas at that time because this gas is non inflammable it means it don't catch fire but unfortunately helium gas is not much available so hydrogen gas was used at that time and hydrogen gas is easily available and much cheaper than helium and it is quite easy to float air ship and my dear friends hindenburg ship was the also made with the such advanced technology it could fly with both the gas and also set the gas in different parts in its architrave despite the gas leaks there is no need to see heavy destruction in that time it was once everyone dream of luxurious ship at this time because inside there was a luxurious cabin and very nice dining room in which you can enjoy your dinner while listening to your lovely music it was time of 1930 when smoking was not such a big crime and people are not so stupid that they start smoking anywhere in this luxurious airship and for this reason hindenburg has separate smoking room was built where people comfortably burn their cigarette it also prepared by pressurized smoking room so that, that hydrogen does not reach it and friend the biggest responsibility of this ship was to provide security as well as luxurious although the rooms available to the passenger in aircraft were little small but if we talk about comfort and luxurious then there is no shortage of any kind in it and friends something was similar was the day on 3 may 1937 when the hindenburg ship made its last flight with 36 passenger and 108 crew members and the ship flew from germany to new jersey and the distance of both of us is 6500 km that had to be done within 3 days within 30 second of flight it reached a height of 60 meter and then about 1 minute later the airplane was moving at its top speed and then it was released on 3 may 1937 on may 6 he has to land at the airport of new jersey this luxurious ship flew comfortably till 5 may but suddenly the weather started getting very bad and due to this delightful 12 hours late and for this reason this cheerful airship was late for 12 hours and should have to reach there on may 6 from about 6 in the morning but this ship was 1113 km away from his destination on may 6 people were attend the important event on 10 am in the morning so the speed was increased to around 2 am during the day and the captain reached 80 km away from his destination but due to the sudden hurricane storm ship was refused to land and to avoid the storm the ship diverted to southwest and now hindenburg tried to get away from the storm and after spending 2 hours in the air like this again 512 came a message from airport in new jersey that he could land his flight when it started landing towards airport 
the wind changed its position. Passenger already was quite late, and for this reason, captain decided to bring this airship against air. But after doing this, airship rear part is bending, and it is very important for any aircraft to fully balance during the landing. So the captain dropped 1,000 liter of water from rear part of the ship, but still it was not completely balanced. Then captain ordered the six crew member from rear part of the airship to come forward. But even after doing this, the ship was not balanced completely. Then fire was started in the rear part of the airship and slowly fire was spread. In a few seconds, it was completely burned down the rear part. The fire had started going very fast. However, some people jumped out of the window. Of this blessing, they saved their life. Actually, this was done because it was come very close to the ground, and in the end, 36 out of 97 people were killed. Due to their understanding and good luck, they survived from the disaster. There have been bigger plane accidents than this, and all the people who fall in the Hindenburg disaster are VIP category, and most of the people were counted among the richest people of that time. And that was the reason people don't forget the disaster ever. And friends, interesting thing was that this incident was also captured on camera and people are still surprised to see it. And this disaster is also called Titanic of the Sky. Friends, hope you like this video and please subscribe my channel to continue watching such interesting video. And don't forget to press the bell icon. Thank you very much for your valuable time.